In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Bookmap for crypto. Now, the first thing you want to do once you're inside Bookmap, you want to go ahead and hit this plus icon over here, and then you have two options. You can either select over here where it says Futures, and as you can see, you're not able to see anything, or you can go ahead and you can select Perp or Spot, where actually you can find some crypto. So if I go to Perp, over here, as you can see, there's a bunch of different cryptos you can add, different crypto pairs paired with USDT or you can select spot over here as well where you'll be able to see a bunch of them as well so for example let's say we want to look at uh, I don't know let's say you want to look at ETH USDT I'm gonna click on that over here and then of course you want to click on subscribe at the bottom of course before that you can also add in some advanced options such as tick size size, granu size granularity and then the historical data and here you want to click on subscribe and then OK, as you can see over here, it says that my license can only display up to two bookmap data instruments at a time. So I'm going to press OK over here. But of course, if uh, essentially you have a subscription or if you don't have two over here already, you'll be able to then display more. So that's pretty much it. That's how to can, you can use bookmap for crypto. You can basically add them the way I showed you. So just use either spot or perp over here and you'll be able to find some of them. So that's that. I hope this video helped you out. If if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.